Welcome to InfraBright's 3-Minute Tutorials. In this tutorial, we'll talk about how InfraBright's Knowledge Grid is built. As the data is being loaded, it's first parsed into columns. Each column is then divided into equal groupings of elements, called data packs. Each data pack contains 65,536 elements. Next, three different knowledge nodes are created for each data pack by extracting summary information from the data. These knowledge nodes are called data pack nodes, numerical histograms, and character maps. A fourth knowledge node, called pack to pack is built when a query joining two or more tables is run. The knowledge grid is then built from these knowledge nodes during the load process. Reference information about which knowledge node belongs to which data pack is kept separately in a MyISEM table within the InfraBright instance. The knowledge grid is a summary of information about the data, collected automatically during the load process. It's the key to InfraBright's fast analytical queries on large volumes of data. The summary information stored in the knowledge grid is used to answer queries directly or to narrow down the relevant data packs, reducing the overall I.O. by only decompressing and reading data relevant to the query. When new data is loaded in the future, the knowledge grid will automatically be expanded to include the corresponding new knowledge nodes. Compare this to traditional and labor-intensive indexes that require rebuilding at each load. The knowledge grid has a very small footprint of about 1% of the compressed data. It doesn't need to be set up or configured beforehand, and it doesn't need to be maintained by the user. It's simple and seamless. Data packs are compressed at an average ratio of 10 to 1, so starting with 1 terabyte of raw data, for example, the compressed data will be about 100 gigabytes, and the associated knowledge grid will be about 1 gigabyte. The building of the knowledge grid happens automatically during a load, an update, or an insert, and remains permanently on file for the InfraBright optimizer to use to resolve queries faster and more efficiently. For more information about what we do and how we do it, come visit us at infobright.com and our community site at infobright.org.